Happy New Year and welcome back to school. My name is Peter Noonan and I'm the superintendent here in the City of Falls Church Schools and it is my privilege and honor to welcome you back to the 2023-24 school year. I am doing a video this year as opposed to a written uh, letter simply because um, I want to make sure you get a chance to see uh, a name and a face and get to know who I am if you're new in the City of Falls Church and also at the same time uh, reintroduce you to, uh, to me. Um, I have been fortunate enough to been in the school system now for starting my seventh year as superintendent and this year is one of the most exciting years um, that I have had an opportunity to kick off in the time that I've been here in the City of Falls Church. We really are in a place uh, where um, coming out of the last several years and all that that has entailed, uh, we get a chance to not uh, forget what happened, but in many ways sort of turn the page and get back to um, the really great work of being in school, uh, working hard and uh, learning together, living together and spending a lot of time together. So I am really excited. Uh, and so are our teachers. This last uh, Tuesday, we had an opportunity uh, to meet with all of our teachers and all of our staff at our annual convocation at Meridian High School. And the enthusiasm and excitement for this year was absolutely palpable among everyone in the room, whether it was bus drivers, food service workers, our custodians, our maintenance workers, our folks in daycare, our technology workers, all of our central office people, our staff in the schools as well as our teachers have been working diligently throughout the summer getting ready to welcome all of you and your students back to our schools. My hope is that you've had an opportunity now, uh, at least in some of our sites, to be able to get in and see where some of your classes are. Uh, we've got Meet the Teacher coming up and lots of exciting things happening on our way towards back to school nights uh, in the not too distant future. Um, as we get back to school this year, there are several things that I'm really excited about. First and foremost, I want to just celebrate our staff. Uh, we have now, for the fifth year in a row, been named the best school division in the Commonwealth of Virginia, for, and that is based on a variety of metrics and measures to include student achievement, um, the work of our workforce, our, our workplace, our environment, uh, and the like. Um, I also want to celebrate the fact that this last uh, June, and we didn't have an opportunity to talk much about it, um, we were recognized by the Washington Post as one of the top workplaces in the uh, D.C. metro area. And that was based on feedback directly from our staff in anonymous surveys to the Washington Post. Um, and what we know is that great working conditions in our schools translate into great student conditions in the classrooms. So I'm happy to report to you that over 90% of our staff and faculty here believe that this is a great place to work or an excellent place to work and are so excited to be here. Um, so so our, our big focus this year um, is really on our strategic plan. And I think many of you have had an opportunity to hear me talk about the strategic plan, so I won't go into detail. But I will say that there was, there is one aspect of our strategic plan that we're going to be focusing very closely on this year, and that is wellness, equity, and belonging, or WEB for short. Um, and what that means for us and you is that we are trying to continue to cultivate the very best climate and culture that we can within our schools. That means showing kindness and care for each other, being supportive of each other, and always working together between the schools and our homes and our students to make the best opportunities for our students and ensure that they not only learn what's happening in the classroom, but also learn how to be good people. And that is part of, obviously, the IB Learner Profile, ensuring that all of our students graduate with all of the traits of that IB Learner Profile. Um, that means that we need to remain in strong partnership with each other. And I want to just say up front that um, the City of Falls Church families have been incredible partners with the schools since I've been here for the last six years. And I want to thank you in advance for, again, being great partners with us this year. Um, as we start the school year, just like every year, there are going to be some glitches. 
Uh, and I want to just put that out there. There are going to be some buses that are going to be late. There might be some bus routes that are slightly off. We may have a glitch in the cafeteria where um, someone doesn't get the lunch that they wanted. Uh, we're still finalizing some class schedules for some of our students. We're still finalizing some placements and the like. But rest assured, just like every other year, these things happen and they always settle out within the first or second week. And our kids are incredibly resilient and we'll be fine. So I ask for just a little bit of gracious space as we get the year started, knowing that there are going to be some glitches. And if there is, um, certainly reach out to us. Uh, reach out to your principals in your schools and know that they will be well prepared along with the staff to help manage and negotiate through that uh, with you. Um, but please know that in every year, and this is my 33rd, uh, every two weeks, the first two weeks of school, there's always some glitches, but we're able to work through those and by the second week we have hit our stride and things are cooking along just as smooth as can be. Um, I am looking forward to an incredibly um, excellent year this year. Uh, we've had a lot, as I've said, going on for the last several years uh, and this is the year that we're going to turn the page. Again, not forgetting what has happened in the past, but really looking forward um, and looking forward and being in the moment right now of what's happening in our schools and helping our kids perform successfully in school and on the field and in clubs and activities uh, and in all the things that they do. Because at the end of the year and at the end of a student's career here in the City of Falls Church, we all want the same thing. We want an incredibly well-rounded student who is prepared for college or career, whatever the case may be. And by the way, the skill set for each of those is the same. Um, so our job is to prepare kids to make sure that they have choices by the time that they leave high school. And we are committed to that and committed to ensuring that all students learn at really high levels. So anyway, I will stop there. Um, but I did want to say just hello and thank you again for your incredible investment here in the City of Falls Church Schools, in your children, and in our teachers and staff that support them every single day. And here's to a great 23-24 school year, and I will uh, send another message in about a month or so, filling you in on how things are going. All right, uh, have a great start to the school. Hope you got all of your back to school shopping done. Lunches are uh, ready to be packed, and uh, we are off. But if, by the way, if you don't have a lunch ready to be packed, we have the very best food services here in the City of Falls Church. We make all our food from scratch and uh, would welcome you to purchase our food as well. So with that, have a great year and I uh, look forward to seeing you. Take care. Bye-bye.